Hello, I'm currently in the middle of putting together a bunch of new paintings for my next art show, which should be happening in June, and ran into a little problem. My normal working method is to make some shit on the computer and print it out, then I use this nice cheap opaque projector to project the image onto blank canvas, and then I trace it. And then I take what I traced and I paint on top of it. Now, you might think that tracing is cheating, but you know what? I've done it the hard way. In fact, I showed you in a previous video me doing it using the grid technique. Um, freehand is about 20 hours, grid technique is about 16, this is about 45 minutes. So, this, I feel I've proven I can do it manually. It's okay to cheat because it saves time and ultimately ultimately lets me get more done cheaper. Unfortunately, if you take a quick look, my printer seems to be running out of ink, specifically yellow in this case. It starts off fine, but then it just kind of craps out to shades of blue. Most people just head out and buy new ink, but I really didn't want to sell my car, remortgage my house, sell some vital organs on the black market. I just wanted to trace things. So rather than spending a fortune on ink, I decided to build myself a DIY high definition digital projector. No, seriously, that actually is cheaper than buying ink. Step one is to find an old laptop you're not using anymore. Uh, that's an old one. If you find it difficult to tear apart an old computer that you've had for years and spent a lot of time on and spent a lot of money on a long time ago, Try tearing apart a friends. That's a lot easier. If you carefully pry apart the screen, you'll get something that looks like this. It's just a translucent screen. See, there's normally reflectors and a backlight and all sorts of fancy stuff. This is just a filter, because an LCD works by light going through it, and this filters out the colors you don't want. And the furnace has gone on. Lovely. So now you just put the LCD on top of an overhead projector, turn it on, and bam. High definition digital projector for almost free. Of course, you can see what it's projecting a whole lot better when I haven't already traced and painted it and when the lights are off. But if I do that, you won't be able to see anything. So yeah, there we go. And that's how you turn an old laptop and an overhead projector into your very own do-it-yourself digital projector. Hey Kyle, have you seen my laptop? I gotta go.